Hello, Glimple. Welcome to our February edition of Glimple at a Glance. This is our chance to talk about what's going on in the city, as well as share some things that's happening at some of our council meetings. So let's talk for a minute about some personnel things that's going on and some new employees you're going to see and some promotions that we've got coming up. At our February 7th council meeting, uh, the police department recognized two brand new employees that they've got. The first one was a dispatcher, Macy Willett, and then our brand new police officer, Sydney Fleetwood. We want to welcome both of them uh, to the city. I know they're going to do great things and appreciate their service being here in the city. But uh, this month also as well, we're going to be uh, promoting uh, two new supervisor positions within the police department. And so our first one was Master Patrol Officer Anthony Wind. He will be promoted to Corporal here later this month. And the second one was Master Patrol Officer Wes Johnson. He'll be promoted to Sergeant. Congratulations to both of you. We're looking forward to great things uh, in your careers here in the city. Uh, but the council also added several new positions here recently um, to our budget. So in January, they met, reviewed our budgets, and added some new positions as a part of it in our public safety and finance departments. So our fire department got three new firefighter positions. Our police department got a new lieutenant position, a new patrol officer, and they moved our part-time animal control to full-time because we continue to have um, a need there for more animal control officers in our city. Our finance department also got a controller's position that we're going to be adding that will help us with our budgets, help us with um, a number of things that, that we're just growing and we need some help with in that department. So uh, we're going to be adding positions to our city. So if you are interested in working for the city, if you think you want to be one of the people that helps make a difference in this community and to serve this community, then I would encourage you to go out to our website, look up the job opportunities that are there and see how you can help us. Because in addition to those opportunities we've already talked about with the police department and in the fire department and in our finance department, um, we've got additional personnel that we're looking for as well. Uh, we've had a couple new businesses open recently. I'm sure you've seen um, these pieces on Facebook, but we want to mention them here. I want to welcome Taco Bell. They opened this last month, as well as Come and Go just recently opened this month. But we've also got some new businesses that will be opening up here soon. In January, the council approved the sign package, the digital package. Those are special approvals that require uh, council approval on that for Wendy's. And so we expect them to open here in the next couple of months. And we've also got Frank Oma Pottery. If you don't know about Frank Oma Pottery, um, go check them out. Uh, they've got some great information out there. Check out our Facebook page. Uh, we, we copied a post that uh, a story that was done on them. Uh, we are uh, excited to have them become a part of our community and to restart their business here locally with us in Glenpool. In January, the council also approved phase two of Glen Hills Addition. So that's an additional 78 lots, uh, 78 brand new homes that's going to be coming online in the near future. So uh, we continue to grow across the board, both commercially and residentially, and looking for great things for our community in the near future. Uh, we are already planning for our wet, red, white, and boom bash. Uh, for this summer. We had our first annual event last year, the inaugural event. It was great. And we had a bunch of fun that night. So hopefully you'll be uh, come out and join us this summer. We're going to be talking about it in the coming months. But if you want to be a part of that, if you've got a business that you want to uh, sponsor parts of it or you want to help out, get a hold of our community relations director, Leanne Reed. She can help you find ways for you to plug in to what we're doing out there for this event. Also, uh, we will be closed for President's Day on uh, February 21st. And so just note, City Hall, City Buildings will be closed on that day. But that also means that our council meeting that would normally be set for that night is moved to Tuesday, the 22nd of February. So just make a note of that if you keep up with what's going on at our council meetings. Uh, but if not, we'll be talking about it here next month. Hey, we'll see you then, Glenpool.